Hello again, this is Tim Godby of Bolin Technology, and I have another video in our Dante AV series for you today. This one is all about latency. Now, in the AV over IP world, it's all about the highest quality video and the lowest possible latency. Dante AV excels at both of those things. Now, there are at least two different ways I could show you this. There's a scientific method, which we have done, and I'm going to make that video for you. But there's also a more fun way of showing real world latency, and that's what I want to do today. So we're going to switch to a diagram so I can explain to you exactly what we have here. As you can see, we have a smaller Dante AV network set up today. We have a host PC running Dante controller and some rich media content, as well as the stop clock which is hours, minutes, seconds, and milliseconds, which I will also show you. That's going in through a D20 encoder and then onto our Dante AV network, which is managed by our Netgear M4250 PoE++ managed switch. The signal then is being sent out to a D20 decoder and a D20S decoder, and we have a monitor at the end of each of those, one HDMI, one SDI. So, let me show you the actual content. Well, we're all about fun here at Bolin Technology, so we thought we'd show you some rich media content. It just happens to be Kung Fu Panda 2. Why? Because it's really cute. What we also wanted you to see is that we turned the subtitles on so you could tell how low the latency is. This is fast motion content being encoded and decoded across the Dante AV network. As a reminder, this monitor is the HDMI loop out from the encoder. So this is pre-encoding. This monitor is across the Dante AV network from the decoder, straight from HDMI. This one across the Dante AV network coming out SDI. So straight from the source, over the network, over the network. As you can see, that's really impressive. All right, let's go to a little bit more of a scientific approach. Bye Kung Fu Panda 2. This is again is our stop clock in hours, minutes, seconds, and milliseconds. So I'm gonna start this. Well. And let you see that this is much harder to determine actually. And what I encourage you to do as you're watching this YouTube video is pause it. Just take a look for yourself at what the numbers are. I need to point out there are always differences between HDMI and SDI in terms of latency. It's usually a few milliseconds, but that may be different for you. But I'm also going to take you into the video editor and step through this recording a frame at a time. Now that will be a much better indication for you of what was happening across the Dante AV network. So again, we do plan to show you the more scientific approach to measuring latency. That'll be a fun one to make and to show you. But we thought it would be interesting for you to see real world examples of what Dante AV can do across the network when it comes to high quality video and ultra low latency. Thanks as always for your time today and for watching this video. Please consider subscribing to the channel and turning on notifications so you'll always know when we post new content and I'll see you in the next video.